What it do, man? It's your boy Battle Troop coming to you live and direct from the Battle Troop headquarters. Let's get right off into this, man. I got to address some things right quick, man. Listen, man. For all y'all people who waiting and expecting for Chris Unbiased to come back, listen. He's not coming back. He done. He done. Move on. Dry your eyes. Move on. Find something else to do. He not coming back. Find something else to do. You know why? Okay. Now, I saw this one brother who be covering Chris Unbiased case. Some older man looking dude. And he like, yeah, you know, uh, you know, Chris going to be back real soon. And, you know, Chris is going to beat his cases because I looked into the case. And when I saw this, I said, oh, he's going to beat this. And, you know, he, he's going to beat this, you know. So, you know, he'll be back real soon. And then, Listen, man, who you talking to? No. If that's the case, you would have just been specific and just talk, went in detail and talked about it. It's an open case. It's public knowledge. But he didn't. But he wanted to throw that out there to get people to believe in a Chris, some type of innocence, some type of, you know what I'm saying, um, wrongfully accused type thing. Right. But you open about every other case in details, but not open in details about this one. But you read into it. You look so much into it. You seen the details and everything about it that you just know he going to beat it. But I'm not going to talk about it. Even though it's public records, public knowledge. But you're not going to talk about it. But he definitely going to beat it based upon the evidence and knowledge that you have been doing your research on it. But I'm not going to tell you people. It's a surprise. Be expecting. Watch he come. No. No, 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 no. No. Get out of here with that trash. Who you talking to? Chris been out for over a year now. Right? And yet, we still haven't seen no sighting of him whatsoever on social media showing his face. Now, I know a person be like, oh, he released a message on Facebook. But let me tell y'all something. Do you know why he can't show his face? He can't show his face because no convicted sex offenders can be on social media. That's the only case. That's the only case that prevents you from being on social media. Or um, maybe some type of computer fraud, fraud or tampering type stuff. But other than that, no. No. That's why he's not on social media. Because if you're charged with any sex offender case, you cannot be on social media. You can't. Because that's against the law. Because this is where children is at. On social media. And if you are a convicted pedophile. Or rapist. It is against the law to be on social media. And that's why he can't show his face. That's why he's not showing his face. All these people talking about he innocent. All these people talking about he finna be home. I mean, he finna beat the cases. But yeah, he been home again for over a year. Bonded out and everything. But he can't go on social media. But he can't be on social media. That's why. If he... I, I, I spoke to... Uh, I spoke to Caps yesterday. And Caps told me he spoke to him. And Chris told him he beat all his charges. I said, okay, so why he ain't on social media? Why he not, why he not addressing the battle rap community that he was so loved in 
on that good news. Seeing when he left, this was the last impression we known to him, that you got indicted on a rape charge. One of the charges said a 10-year-old. That's what one of the charges said. 10-year-old, minor, under 10. One of them. If you beat all the charges, why aren't you expressing that to the battle rap community you were so loved, established in, as, as, as at that time, the number one blog in the game and getting a nice check from it. So you got a channel that's generating all this money for you. So you abandon your channel? You don't want no check? For free? URL just signed this big caffeine deal for multi-million dollars and you was their guy. You was their homie. You was in position probably better than Jay Black was. Or if you was going to be equal to him, they had you on they trailers and had you on all they uh shows and um platforms even when you was gone. You don't want to come back. You don't want to get your seat. This where you know that. This where you popular at. This where you was big at. This is what was paying you. So you innocent beat all your charges. You don't want to clean that up. You know how big your channel would be if that was true? If that was really true, you know how big your channel would be? If that was true? If that was true, do you know how big your channel would be? Your channel would be big if that was true. It'd be super big. But something wrong, it must not be true. Why do we say that? It must not be true. Because you ain't speaking up proving it. Since you beat all your charges, you ain't on the internet. Where being on the internet proves you not guilty. But since you're not on the internet and you can't show your face, since you're not on the internet and you can't show your face and you... is guilty, you don't supposed to show your faith. You're going to get in trouble. That's why, y'all, that's common sense. If he's innocent, he can show his face. If he's innocent, he can do a blog. Why wouldn't you if you're innocent? Come on, what type of sense do that make? If I'm innocent of something that I was convicted of and I was proven to be innocent, I can do a blog. I can show my face. I'm going to use that to say, I told y'all I didn't do that. And everybody who said I did that apologized. Not only that, I want my position back. My channel finna be booming. My fan base finna go up. I'm finna make a lot of more money now because uh, everybody want to hear my story. I've been gone for so long. So I'm going to be a high demand. The URL and them got a place for me and everything. But that's not the case. That's not the case now, is it, people? Right, because he know he guilty. Because he know he guilty. That's why he can't show his face. Because he allegedly, allegedly he guilty. But that's common sense, y'all. If you beat all the charges on something you were charged with, and you was the number one blogger in your community... Where well, your channel was bringing you in all these thousands of dollars and you in good with the biggest company in battle rap that call you they guy, your man, and you getting free passes with your cameras and everything and interview with the bloggers and the battle rappers and the league on. He had all that before he left. What's the problem now? Why wouldn't you address it? Why wouldn't you let it be known you were found not guilty? He can't. And this is why y'all don't see him on social media. Because sex offenders and rapists can't be on social media.
or you're going to get in trouble. We just saw Ter Tory Lane just got charged with the Megan Thee Stallion shooting, and he went to social media now just telling his story. We didn't say Meek Mills, Kodak Black, them. We didn't say Six Nine, them. Takashi Six Nine, them. Everybody telling their stories on social media. Why he can't? Why he ain't been able to? That dog fought it, man. Oh man. Why he ain't been able to? Cause he can't. He gonna get in trouble. That's why. So all these people talking about, and I saw them do a blog on that. And it had plenty likes on it. It was plenty people like, and I saw, I saw that one dude. Somebody put that up there. It had plenty likes on it. Talking about he finna, he he finna come home and he finna be back in no time in 2020. Expect him coming back in 2020. It had plenty likes on it. I'm like, that's sad, man. These people really, really, really <laughs> want this man. They want this man to actually uh, <laughs> get off the hook for this stuff. That's crazy. They want him to get off the hook for it. I don't. You did it. You deserve Everything happened to you. If you did it, you deserve everything happened to you. But it had plenty likes on it, man. I was like, this is crazy, man. But it is what it is, man. It's your boy Battle True. He ain't coming. He ain't coming back, y'all. He can't, he can't, he's not allowed on social media. I'm sorry. He's not allowed on show, social media. That's why, that's why y'all ain't seen no blog from him. No statement from him, him him trying to defend himself in any type of way, because he can't. He gonna get in trouble. You're a sex offender, got a rape case, or molesting children. You can't be on social media. Wish you would go on YouTube. You're going to jail. See, they know him now. See, remember when he when when he was charged with that stuff at first. See, see, here's the thing. Y'all remember before he caught this case, him and Queen Flip was into it. Before he caught this case, him and Queen Flip was into it. And Queen Flip digged into his background and found out some stuff that he was so-called charged with and everything and was trying to talk, hitting on how he got a history of doing some foul, funny type stuff. But he was still on social media. Then this case hit him. And by him being popular and known now, he can't get away with coming on social media no more because people know him now. See, at first he, he, he was able to because he hadn't got big like that. Now he known. He big. He can't show his face like that no more. Now they know like, oh, that's the unbiased dude from Battle Rap, right? What he doing on internet? He got the, this case. So he can't show himself. It is what it is, man. It's your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my job when that's a question of yours. Hit the link in the description box and subscribe to Battle Truth. It ain't my job when that's a question of yours. Join my Patreon if you ain't a member of my Patreon.